Wim0FXP, welcome to my channel, Uniden SDS200. Let's just say, for, for whatever reason, the SD card that you're putting in your device is just no good, not working anymore, you need to make a new one. So get yourself a decent 8GB SD card, and then download a program like, you can go SD card formatter, which is a free program, like we have here. Click yes. Plug your SD card into the PC like I have here with, with an adapter and then you will select it and then format it completely, okay? Yes. Now don't do this to your original SD card because you might need that, who knows? Uh, but this is with a fresh SD card. You can buy these, the 8GB SD cards. They're about £6. Click OK and it's now been formatted. Then download the Sentinel software. I'll put a link in, just click it and download it and run it. It will look like this. Keep the SD card in your PC, not the Uniden, and go to Scanner and then go to the bottom and it says Clear User Data. And it won't show the card straight away, but click this little box here, tick Display All Devices, and click OK. Clear User Data now. It says it gives you the warning, but remember this isn't affecting your this isn't affecting your scanner because the SD card is in your PC, so don't worry, you're not gonna affect your scanner. So we'll let that run. <clears throat> and that should put all the files that you need for at least the scanner to boot up, and then you can connect it to the computer in the normal way just with a micro USB lead at the front and then straight into your computer. So click OK and then the next thing you do is take out the SD card, put it into your SDS200, make just carefully slot that in, turn it on. And then now, it will boot and so now once it's booted when you plug in the micro usb card in the front like so and plug it into your pc like i'm doing now it will come up with the e and then so just press e it's become a usb mass storage and at this point if you want you can go in and you can go update, you can update the database, probably do the firmware first, update firmware, mine probably already been done but we'll do it anyway, yeah it's already got it, click OK and then you go update database, it's already got it, so the quickest way if you're in the USA, because in the UK you're going to have to load in a load of favourites and make create new favourites but if you're um, in USA, you can just unplug the micro USB. Everything will be on there now. Let that boot. Then just go zip code. So we're going to go postcode here, zip services. Select USA. We'll go 10001. Enter. Enter again, and it's now going to load New York on there because that's the zip code. And you'll see it loading. It will take a minute. And then, like I said about favorites, you look here on the left. I've created some favorites. You can go, you can create new favorites, but I, I think that's for a separate video. The main thing is you've lost your SD card. Your device won't boot. I'm lucky. I'm in the UK. I got mine from Moonraker, and they they give you a preloaded favorites list. You know, with the with a lot of the common things that we want to look at, like air band, marine band, shops, business, military. You know, everything that we want to listen to when we're playing around with our with our scanner. So just let this boot up, just to show you how good it is. And that's it. It just starts to boot straight straight away. You've got your systems here, channels, departments, systems and so on and so on. It's an excellent, excellent, if you enjoy using, you know, scanning and listening with a nice big colour screen, this is the one. Um, if you want, in the, in the UK, if you really want one that's 
tried, tested, and has a very good reputation, then I would say go for the Whistler TRX1 or 2, or both, you know, otherwise. I do really like the SDS100, so the handheld version of this, because that's a lot more portable. You can go around, park in the car. You could do that with this. I mean, it's it will work off your cigarette lighter in your car. It's a bigger device. You put it on the dashboard. You can have great fun with it with a little external antenna. Thanks for watching my channel. 7-3, all the best.